As SSDs grow in popularity, whether used for data centers, PCs, laptops, or any appliance or system that requires storage, it's important to look beyond just speed and capacity, particularly when you want to understand how long they will last. Two core metrics that explain endurance are terabytes written and drive writes per day. Hi, I'm your Kingston AI avatar, and in this video, we'll explore the distinctions between the two and how they are calculated. So let's talk about terabytes written, or TBW. Terabytes written is the total amount of data that can be written to an SSD over its usable life. It's a good indicator of how long a drive will last under normal operating conditions. How we calculate this is by taking the capacity of the drive, then multiplying it by the number of program array cycles that each NAND block can perform, and then dividing this by the right amplification factor. A quick note, the program array cycle is determined by how many times a memory cell can be written and erased before it becomes unreliable or inconsistent. And the right amplification factor indicates how much additional work the SSD must do to store data. Okay, let's give you an example of terabytes written in the real world. If a 1.92 terabyte SSD has a terabytes written rating of 3,504, it basically means that the drive can endure the writing of 3,504 terabytes of data before it is likely to encounter failures. So next is drive writes per day or DWPD. Drive writes per day takes a slightly different perspective and calculates how many times a drive can be fully written to per day over its warranted lifespan. This is important for high intensity workloads, like in a server or data center environment. To work out the drive writes per day value of an SSD, we use the following calculation. The terabytes written value of an SSD multiplied by 1000, this number is then divided by 365 days multiplied by the number of warranty years and then multiplied again by the SSD capacity in gigabytes. For instance, if a 7.68 terabyte SSD has a terabytes written value of 14,016 and a warranty period of five years, the DWPD calculation is as follows. First, we take the TBW value of 14,016 and then multiply this by 1,000. Next, we take 365 days, multiplied by 5, which is the number of years, then multiply this again by 7,680 gigabytes. Now we divide the upper value by the lower value. In this instance, it would result in one drive write per day, meaning that the SSD can handle writing its entire capacity every day over its five-year warranty period. So, in summary, terabytes written is useful for understanding the overall durability of a drive over its lifespan, whereas drive writes per day is key in understanding how well a drive can endure daily workloads, especially in enterprise and data center environments. Both metrics are key considerations when choosing an SSD, particularly in scenarios where you intend to use the drive, in data-intensive tasks, and constant write operations. If you need support choosing the right SSD, our Ask an Expert team is on hand to answer your questions and offer objective advice. For more information, please visit kingston.com slash askanexpert.